Hello and welcome back. This is video number two of My God is Real, for I can feel him in my soul. We did a demo in the previous video, the very first video, and so I just wanted to take a few moments and begin with the intro chords that I used. Um, again, this is not the only way, it's merely a way of looking at the song. So uh, we're in B flat. Two flats, B flat and E flat. And uh, let me just play the intro chords one time and I'll try to get it as close to the demo as I can remember. Let's try it. Starts on four sharp. That was a little closer in format. One more time. Okay, so let's slow it down. Uh, so we start, um, I call it a four sharp because that's just how my brain works and thinking about the the bass or the root. And you can actually call it C7 or secondary dominant if you want. This is the first chord in the intro, but let me just set it up like uh, I just played it for you. E natural in the bass, then C sharp, E natural, G natural, B flat. So this is a type of diminished chord. If you'd like to look at it from that angle, you can. And that's where it starts. And that's where this part begins with that little pickup. So your next chord is actually uh, B flat but I just put the root in second inversion, or just use the F in the left hand. So I have an F in the low part, B flat in the thumb, D natural in the index finger, F natural in the third finger. So it's a B flat chord, just using the F in the bass. Next chord is G minor. So you're looking at G minor in the bass, at B flat in the thumb, D natural in the index finger, G natural doubled in the pinky, G minor. C major add nine is how it's voiced. So C natural in the left hand, E natural, G natural, B flat, D natural. That's your nine. Next chord, F7, 
and uh, maybe off the screen, so I'll just call it out. In the pinky of the left hand, you have an F natural. Then thumb of left hand, you have E flat. Then thumb of the right hand is F natural. Index finger is A natural. Third finger is C natural. F7, nice and simple. G minor, C9, F7, and back home to B flat. So regular B flat, D, F, B flat chord. And then I did a little turn around right here and I just put four over the one, the E flat, E flat, G natural, B flat, right there. And I just left that all over the root. Just a little passing chord. You may want to just practice that a little bit. Here's where the little interesting jazz chords came in, and I'm not going to delve too much in, into the theory behind it, although I very much enjoy it. Um, for most of our viewers, it may not be applicable for them yet, so if you need or would like a little more um, theory background on this, feel free to email me, pianoryland at gmail.com, and I'll be happy to try and help. So let's proceed. Let's go back and get to that point. A very dissonant chord, and rightfully so. So what is happening here, we have a D natural in the bass, left hand, D natural. Then we have a D flat. First finger of the right hand. Then we have an F natural. And then an A flat. So you have a D flat major chord over a D. D flat over D. Next chord is I'm going to switch my fingers around. C minor over E flat. So you have E flat in the left hand, left finger. Right thumb is C natural, third finger is E flat, pinky is G natural. Next chord, that B flat major over the F natural. All I did was just change the bass up a little bit. So you got F natural, B flat, D natural, F. Another interesting chord. All right, G diminished is one way you can look at it. So you got G natural, B flat, D flat, E natural. position and then you end back on one or tonic or home you can voice it like that if you like B flat major chord B flat D 
F, B flat, D. All right, let's do it slowly together. A one, two, three, go, and a one. Remember, that occurs very quickly. Here, one more time. That's the tempo we're going for. But don't worry, it takes a while to get all that process. So D flat over D. So one and uh, go and uh, one. Huh, sounds just like a B flat major scale, doesn't it? All right, so that's the left hand. Let's drop that off for now and go back to our D flat major chord and uh, go. Trying to keep my fingers out of the line of sight so you can see them. And uh, go. Let's do that one again. And go. And go. Let's put the left hand and go. Three, four, go. One more time and go. Let's just uh, put it all together now before we close this video portion. And then one. questions. See if I can help in any way. Piano Ryland. P-I-A-N-O-R-Y-L-A-N.